Hello everyone, and welcome. My name is Rune, and today we're going to be playing some Oxygen Not Included. This is uh, kind of like a base management game, base builder. Uh, and we're just going to start playing. I have played this a bit before. I'm not at all good at it. Um... Let's just leave stuff kind of base. See how that goes. Okay. Well, that loading didn't take very long. I want to influence the type of uh, duplicate that I'm going to roll here. I want a builder. Um, researcher for sure. And probably a digger. So I want the researcher. I'm gonna re-roll it a little bit. I'd like to get the researcher. There we go, farming. Okay, so decreased strength is fine for that. Bathroom use speed. That'll be annoying, but that's fine. Um same thing there. I mean yeah, that should work. Um Name the colony <laughs> the inescapable panopticon. Alright. Um The Flem Coated Factory, I, I love it. Alright. Okay. So we have Camille, Travaldo, and Lindsay. Well, let's start by digging some stuff out. We need materials to do kind of anything. We got a big old space right there. I don't need any of these tutorials. We better get an outhouse built. Probably sooner than the digging, because that, that becomes an issue quickly. Uh, I know that I can't build the cots near this, because that outputs light. And that kind of messes up their sleeping. They won't sleep well near it. Got my water right here, which is very nice. Zoom out a little bit, see what we got going on. So we got copper up there, that's fine. Some coal, coal, algae, that's great. More water. Alright, so we kind of got materials everywhere. Um, how the hell do I see temperature again? Right there. Okay. So we got heat over there. Heat, 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 okay. Things are generally going to be heating up. That's typically how it goes. Uh, got a shine bug. Unfortunately, I'm going to kill that. Because that will just fly around wherever the hell it wants and will also disrupt my uh, guy's sleeping. We'll dig that. Set a ladder down. Tiles. I need that to be lower though. How am I going to do that? I need to lower the water. Maybe just like that. Because I want to be able to have a layer that they can walk on. And then obviously this is going to be my base layer, but they need two to be able to walk. So I can't have it be like there, because if I have it there, then they can't walk. I need it to be one lower. 
so they can hold their breath for a while. That's that's fine. Um, yeah, they're probably just gonna sleep on the ground for today. But dig those out at least. Try and bring the water level down. I'm definitely gonna have to dig more than that. That's fine. So oxygen, always an issue. The game is called oxygen not included. Though they do include some. Very nice of them. You start out with very oxygen enriched environment here, and then these oxalites are slowly producing more as I consume it. They'll stop producing once uh, the oxygen is at a specific pressure. You can see it's uh, 1,400 grams per block, I guess, whatever. Kind of size that is. Okay, so I can't... Oops. I can't dig that stuff. can dig that. Just going to have to dig it down a couple then, I think. I know you guys don't like being cold and underwater, but... I need you to. I think we can probably start doing tiles. I better make sure. Yeah, I know. This is even lower. You know what? That's fine. It's not going to look pretty at first. I don't care. I'm going to speed it up just a little bit. For a moment. Can he get up that, or is he going to die? Okay, he can get up that. That's fine. Uh, I think we're good without those being dug, actually. I think that they're hypothermia. I suppose you would be quite cold down there, wouldn't you? Are you going you gonna to heat up at all? I guess it takes time. Okay. So let's go back to base speed. Okay. What I want to do is build them some rooms. But I'm going to be an asshole and just give them all the same room right there. And that should be fine for now. So they exhale a lot of carbon dioxide where they sleep and I want that typically to fall. This area is going to fill up with carbon dioxide. You can see some there. And what I need to do, why can't I, there we go, is uh, have an opening there for now. There are uh, tiles that will allow oxygen to pass through, or gases rather, not just oxygen. But uh, I don't have them researched yet. So, what are you going to do? Go ahead and place three cots. I don't think that a cot can be placed on a ladder, that's why I'm doing that. And uh, let's speed stuff up a little bit. Alright, so it's downtime. Yes, they're going down there to get some food. Food is stored here, what they started me with. Just some nutrient bars. It should be. Yeah, that's a couple days worth of food. Should probably get some growing soonish. But yeah, they're just going to spend their night. I'll go fastest speed for this part. See, she was sleeping near the light, so she got up and moved away. Looks like they got over their hypothermia quickly. That's good. So no oxygen generator has been built. I'll have to build some oxygen diffusers soon. But that requires power. I want to get their sleeping arrangement finished first. Now, this light should not come up here and affect them, I believe. It's not close enough. 
angle doesn't really work there either. And then once I get that done, I guess I'll start working on power, probably. So they like working in the light, so you can use that. Battery. Oh, I'm out of uh, copper. So the closest copper, easiest to get is probably that. Run the power between that and the battery. Replace that with a tile. You can hide uh, these wires in the kind of base tiles. Oops. I better slow everything down a little bit. So I have power, power storage. I had better get some oxygen production. I'm going to send it over there. More centralized. Do have to run power over to it. And that takes power and uh, algae. As you can see, quite a lot of it around. Um, we definitely need a research bench. We'll go ahead and set that over there. I think I'm pretty much out of copper again. Maybe not. So I get that figured out, I can start doing some research. Speed it up a little bit again. There you can see it's pumping oxygen. You can see that uh, it's filling up the pressure. It's pretty much at max pressure for the oxygen diffuser. Oops. Wasting time here. All right, uh, get to researching. I think I need to deal with food first and the compost bin. Very useful. They go to the bathroom in this and uh, eventually it needs to be emptied. You can see it says 12 visits remaining. And then you have polluted dirt. Polluted dirt produces polluted oxygen near it. You don't really want polluted oxygen if you can help it. Not the end of the world, but it's not good either. So, you can make a compost bin to turn that polluted dirt into something. Clay, maybe? I don't recall what it comes out as. Maybe it's fertilizer. I'm not sure. Okay. I'm actually going to pause the game right here. And uh, we'll call that uh, a day for now. Thank you, everyone, for watching. And... Uh, Check back tomorrow. We're going to continue playing this. See you then.